I produced the album uh, myself this time and uh, just go through a few things production wise. R drums were recorded very, very live um, in a place in Wakefield called LS Live. Um, so yeah, we just uh, mic'd it up, everybody in one room, and we just tried to get the energy of uh, of the band onto um, you know onto something that recorded really and capture that uh, essence of the band really. Uh, I think on this album it's it's gone quite close to capturing the uh, the power and the energy that is Saxon. Really. You've got to capture the moment, haven't you? Cheers! Looks very civilised. <laughs> mm. Once more into the breach, dear friends. I, I play a Les Paul made out of uh, wood. Wood, yeah. Wood, <laughs> plastic. <laughs> 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 Yeah, it's, uh, the song itself is uh, is based on um, uh, the Mayan calendar uh, and their civilization. And um, I went to Mexico, uh, I think it was last year, it was a couple of years ago, and we did the tour of the of the sites there. And um, I just thought it was a good thing to write a song about, really. <laughs> shipyard and um, it just struck a chord that rather than sing a song about the Titanic I thought I'd write one about um, you know about the, the the ships that they built there and the big shipyard um, so we called it Made in Belfast. <laughs> about motorcycles and traveling fast and we've never really done one about um, you know Grand Prix driving so I thought it was a good idea to do that.
been to see the um, Terracotta Army on a couple of occasions when it's been on tour. And um, again, it's, an, it's a good subject because you know it was the first uh, it was the first emperor of China, and um, actually everybody forgot about him. They only actually discovered he was the first emperor when they found the tomb. So um, you know, emperors after him it sort of erased his memory. So um, I think it's good. You know, it's a good um, it's a good topic about the warriors all sitting down there, you know, for thousands of years. And then suddenly somebody finds them one day and, uh, you know, there you go. It's the eighth wonder of the world. I keep getting asked, you know, by young bands and generally, um, you know, what's what's the secret, you know, to the band's success, and uh, you know, what what advice have you got for young bands? So I figured I'd write a song, you know, and based on that, really. Um, so, you know, if you listen to the lyrics, it's, it'll become apparent. <laughs> Yeah, Night of the Wolf. Um, again, um, it, it's basically roughly based on a film, really, called Wolf, with Jack Nicholson. I like that film, and uh, who else is in it? She's in it, isn't she? The caller. What's the call? The actresses in Wolf. Jack Nicholson, and. I have no idea. Anyway, great film. So I thought I'd do a song about werewolves, basically. But it, it's loosely based on werewolves. But not really. Best on wolves. Um, so yeah, that's about it really.
and then we move on to um, uh, Wheels of Terror. Um, this was the last song we wrote actually. We wrote this uh, very late on. We only recorded most of the tracks when we did this one. And um, uh, some friends of ours who, uh, <coughs> who um, have a, a video game called Tank, uh, we wrote it for the video game, uh, Wheels of Terror basically. So it's a song about tanks. Then I think we're on with um, standing in the queue then, uh, which is pretty straightforward really. You know, we spend we spend at least 90% of our time waiting around for things to happen, and um, I just thought standing in the queue was was pretty uh, universal really. Pissed off standing in a queue, don't know what to do, thinking of you. Going to the zoo. Yeah, it's all good stuff, really. tour anyway in uh, March we start the tour in um, uh, Scunthorpe don't we and we finish the day after in Basingstoke <laughs> no we start the tour in uh, the USA on in America on in March and uh, South America and we're back into you into England in April and then I think we're doing the rest of Europe in May June July and then we're going to come back after summer break and start it all over again so uh, yeah, so everybody should have plenty of chance to catch us live on tour. So boys, we'll see them all then, yeah? See you, see you then. Bye. Fire!